people with disabilities are not capable of working. That's the biggest lie I ever heard. The minimum wage is offered to everybody, except for people with disabilities. People with disabilities are being paid less than minimum wage. On average, under $2 an hour across the country. How would you like to work for two weeks and come out with a $6 check? It's all based on the assumption that they're less capable than other individuals. No, it's not fair. It could be perfectly legal. The management is making very, very significant six-figure salaries. Companies have told us that if they had to pay half of minimum wage, that they would probably go bankrupt. So they're just building this own business for themselves, don't you think? I'm a person with a dis uh, disability and I've been able to, you know, find jobs that pay me um, what I deserve. I may have a disability, but I can still work. I oversee the Bob Boyd Honda Facebook page. It's great. I interact with customers, I talk to the workers, I get paid. I love it. I work at Powell's Bookstore. I use assistive technology to help me do what I cannot do physically. I am super proud of my job. I'm in the shipping and receiving at the Boston Children's Hospital. Here I am today, a business owner. I own Pop and Joe's Kettle Corn. You know the greatest disability there is? It is low expectation. People with disabilities can be paid sub-minimum wage. We don't feel that's right. There's no reason to pay us less than the minimum wage. When I'm working, I felt that I should be paid as an equal person. Rooted in Rights presents an original documentary. Bottom Dollars. For the full film, go to bottomdollarsmovie.com. Tomorrow. Music by Charles Strauss, lyrics by Martin Charnin, performed by Katrina Mellogram.